Hi, I'm Dr. Chloe Carmichael, and thank you so much for joining me in this video about how to take a performance review. As a clinical psychologist and business coach in New York City, I work with people very often that are pretty nervous about their performance review, or maybe they've gotten a performance review that didn't go so well and they're coming to me for some advice. So first of all, I just want to reframe the fact that maybe you are a little bit nervous about your performance review as actually a good thing. Because what that tells me as a clinical psychologist is that this matters to you, that you're invested in this, that you want to do well. So right there, you're actually off to a really good start. Um, now, if you are at a, at a job where maybe your skills are being challenged as they should be, if you are successfully um, you know, climbing the corporate ladder or whatever it is that your career goals are, um, I just want to say that it's going to be totally normal that you're not going to get a perfect performance review. And for many of us who are used to doing well in life, who really care about things, we almost look at a performance review like an exam where we feel like we're supposed to get a hundred, we're supposed to get an A, and then anything less feels like a failure. So I just want to try to disabuse you of that notion. Performance reviews are, are not supposed to be perfect. In fact, the person giving you the performance review would probably actually be in a little bit of trouble from their manager, their manager, if they said, oh yeah, I gave so-and-so their performance review and I didn't give them any constructive feedback, I didn't give them any constructive criticism. Um, so if you think about it that way, the fact that you're probably going to get some constructive criticism, some constructive feedback, that's actually okay. The person giving you the review is actually just doing what they're supposed to be doing. And the fact that you are in a challenging position where you're learning new things, think of that as a good thing. And again, even the fact that you're a little bit nervous, let's not get nervous about being nervous. Let's actually just normalize the fact that the fact that you might be a little bit nervous simply means that you're excited and invested and that you really want to do well and that those are actually, you're off to a good start there. So let's assume that your performance review is, you know, going and the, the person offers you some constructive feedback and says, well, you know, you're doing really well, but, you know, we'd like to see you do X, Y, and Z a little bit more or a little bit less of ABC or whatever it is. And the typical reaction internally for you is that might kind of sting a little bit. You might be like, oh, oh, you know, gee, I, I, I feel like maybe I was misunderstood or I didn't know I was supposed to do that or something like that. And that's a very, it's an okay reaction to have internally. But what